Becky and Brie. The following contest is scheduled for one fall. It is for the WWE Women's Tag Team Championship. Introducing the challengers, Brie Bella and Nikki Bella, the Bella Twins. Yeah, two sisters who have had yeah. almost paralleled success here in WWE, both former Divas champion. And what's cool to me, guys, is that despite the long road and long career here in WWE, the Bellas will tell you their bond is stronger than ever. They have their own reality show, Total Bellas. How come you guys never come over when I want to watch it? We don't like you. The queen of black hearts. And introducing the champions, first, from Calgary, Alberta, Canada, she is one half of the Women's Tag Team Champions, Natalya! Natalya holds the record for the longest time spent in a Women's Royal Rumble match at 56 minutes. That's a minute for each cat she owns. A third-generation competitor, granddaughter of Stu Hart, niece of Bret Hart, and daughter of Jim Neidhart, Natalia was born to do this. Boy, did someone call for a Glamazon? And her partner from Buffalo, New York. She is one half of the Women's Tag Team Champions. The Glamazon, Beth Phoenix. Beth Phoenix carries every team she has ever been a part of. Glamorella, the Divas of Doom, the NXT commentary table, being married to Edge. Every time she is the dominant member of the group. She's a multi-time women's champion, a Slammy winner for best female competitor, and she's a Hall of Famer. <laughs> Beth Phoenix, one of the all-time greats. Here we go, gentlemen. The tag team titles are up for grabs. Final preparations between partners before the action begins. Long demanded by the WWE Universe and the competitors in the women's division. The women's tag team titles are indeed here, and tonight they're on the line. We've seen alliances in the women's division forming for years, and it's culminating with these pairs facing off for the top prize in women's tag team competition. Oh, Natalia wow. landed it right there. Drop! Oh, Brie Bella able to avoid damage. Snap and take over. Followed by oh, a big boot. Oh, close line. I'm not so sure Natalia should be strutting around like this. At least not yet. 
Bah, straight forearm. The challenger eating up some damage. She's putting up quite a fight here, Cole, but despite that, now is probably a good time to look for the tag. That up. She's dazed in the corner there. If the champ loses the title here tonight, it won't be from lack of conditioning. Talk about being in phenomenal shape. Looking to make a much-needed tag here. And if successful, we may be looking at a whole new match here. So close, just a little bit more. Oh, but it's those last few inches that are always the toughest. And there's the tag. The hit's adding up a little on the champ. The good news is that if it gets too out of control, she has her partner she can tag in while she catches her breath in the corner. A quick reversal by Beth Phoenix. Tattooed with a double axe handle. Nikki Bella is trying to get into her opponent's head. What else is new? Championship. Beth Phoenix quickly breaks the count. Not yet. I don't care who's standing across the ring from Beth Phoenix, Byron. The bottom line is you're simply not going to overpower the Glamazon. Boy, that's the truth. And what makes Beth even more dangerous is that you're likely not going to top her mat game either, which is why she's so difficult to game plan for. A striking blow. Very difficult position to be in right now. Focused attack on the back. Nikki Bella stumbling some here. She's covered by the champ. One. And the kick out by Nikki Bella. She's still in this one. We noted Beth Phoenix's power as well as her strong amateur background, which leads me to wonder, Corey, how in the world do you defeat the Glamazon? Honestly, you've got to have the match of your life. You have to be perfect and hope you somehow find an opening you can exploit. Here's a tag. Opponent off the ropes. Big backdrop. Look at this. Snap suplex. Desperately trying to get to the corner now. It's not going to be easy though, Michael. Next snap. And Beth. Abdominal stretch. It's locked in. This is a great way to wear down your opponent. And what a reversal from Brie Bella. Natalia able to counter beautifully. And you don't see the abdominal stretch very often anymore, guy. No. She breaks it. Wow, she's quite the escape artist, Michael. Oh, oh no. Look way. at the strength of Nikki. Wow. Alabama slam. She's in full control now. The champ getting put to the test here. I really like the resolve we've seen from her in this tag team match, guys. Though, I wouldn't be against the tag here. You know, just so she can gather herself a bit. In a tag team contest, a superstar and partner lock up against another duo. Unless there's a special stipulation added to the match, the traditional rules of a singles match apply in terms of winning the match via pinfall, submission, countout, or disqualification. Kick. Beautiful. The champ to the top turnbuckle. Whoa! Oh, what a splash! Man, oh man. Whoa. And Brie Bella getting the shoulder up. Too early in the match to end it. And what a reversal from Brie Bella. What a wrist clutch suplex. Oh, and she turns it around. 
bodies must be writhing in pain right now. The breaking point must be on the horizon. But yet they continue forward, showing no desire to quit. Brie Bella looking beaten at this point. This is bad, guys. I don't even think she has enough power to get to her corner to make the tag. The submission specialist, Natalia. Oh, yeah, Natalia. This is a heart family tradition. The sharpshooter, Byron. Fight for survival. What an incredible tag team contest. Whenever tag team is on the docket, the mayhem multiplies. Here's the proof. Here are your winners, and still, the WWE Women's Tag Team Champions, Natalya and the Glamazon, Beth Phoenix. Natalya with the finishing touches on this one. Michael, there just may be no stopping these champions, not when they continue to look this impressive. What an exciting match for the Tag Team Championship. Thank you for watching. The following contest is an Extreme Rules match and is for the Intercontinental Championship. Here comes the Lone Wolf. You know, I once asked Baron Corbin, what makes you happy? What drives you? He told me two things. Getting under people's skin and exposing them to their worst fears. A perfect hybrid athlete, size, speed, strength, and skill. Baron Corbin, one of the most dominant forces to attack a WWE ring in recent memory. Former Money in the Bank contract holder. Former United States champion, winner of an Andre the Giant Memorial Battle Royal, the Lone Wolf.
Of course, the title is on the line in this one, guys. And don't be surprised if history is made here tonight. I know the champ has looked good as of late, but I'd say the opposition has looked just as good, if not better. And by the looks of things, I would say the champ is in no mood for playing games here tonight. Nor should he be, Michael. The moment the champ takes the pedal off the medal is the moment he'll lose that title. Introducing the challenger from Kansas City, weighing in at 275 pounds, Baron Corbin! And introducing the champion from Air Scotland, weighing in at 254 pounds, he is the Drew. The challenger not taking their eyes off the championship. And the champ is staring daggers right back at the opposition. This right here is a championship that gained a lot of prestige in short order, guys. Yeah, I mean, once a title match is called by yours truly, you know it finally matters in our industry. Well, you're certainly not Mr. Modest today, are you, Corey? At this juncture, you have to wonder if these superstars can keep up this pace. They're certainly being taken into the deep waters Ooh. now. Look at this. Oh, that's how you establish dominance. cut out for him. Corbin looking on his game right now. And what a reversal from Drew McIntyre. And what a reversal from Baron Corbin. They get dangerous out here, especially when there are no count outs. He's in a bad spot now. Yeah, he's got to find a way out of that corner. Whoa, McIntyre able to avoid damage there. Is there something to focus on when preparing for this career-altering match? you got to accept the fact that you're going to be punished like you've never been punished before. And no mercy will be given. In this situation, you can completely unload on your opponent and a referee's count can't stop you. You can set the rule book ablaze. What is Drew McIntyre looking for here? Defying the laws of physics. Challenger's a little worse for wear now. Yeah, but he expected extreme pain in an extreme rules match. Back suplex. Lightning fast reflexes. The champion into the cover. And a kick out. Much to nobody's surprised. And the match continues. Great counter. Impressive in-ring IQ on display. Wow. Down below. Ouch. Oh, and that's 
the second time. You don't want to get hit with that once, let alone twice. Whack! Michael, that gives new meaning to have a seat. Oh, and he lands it. Really relying on that tonight. Drew McIntyre beginning to peter out here. He's getting beaten up out there, but staying strong. And that's why Corbin's in charge, guys. He's in non-stop attack mode. show, but he needs to make sure he understands what really matters. A oh, striking blow. It's a tough spot to find yourself in, that's for sure. Zip for the ride through the tape with the championship on the line. Near fall after near fall in this matchup here. Drew McIntyre drawing on his incredible reserves right now. Very impressive, Byron. Uh-oh, could it be? We could have a new champion. Hey, what goes up Two. must come down. Not a whole lot of luster behind that kick out. Crowd of show, but he needs to make sure he understands what really matters. Oh, that man just broken something. Thanks for coming. The end of days. The title's in jeopardy here. I think the paradise. Shifted. Tonight, Baron Corbin enters a whole new stage of his career. Many would consider this an upset, Byron. Yeah, a hard fought victory for this superstar, but he definitely earned it. Yeah, look at it. His opponent, sore loser. Yeah, but apparently it backfired. That's what you get for not accepting a loss. And now the celebration can begin. The irresistible force.
And here comes the man. The dominant Nia Jax, she said it herself, she can disarm her opponents with a smile. Or with a vicious right hook. Nia Jax is one of the most powerful, menacing women in all of WWE. And then there's the man, Becky Lynch. When she's not too busy jaw jacking or putting her personal life on full display for the WWE Universe, she can be quite the formidable competitor. That must have been hard for you to admit, Corey. Becky Lynch is fueled by years of frustration and the desire to maintain her long, hard-fought spot at the top. That makes her uniquely dangerous in a way that's not just skill-based. Though Becky Lynch certainly has all the skill it takes, too. And, Corey, Becky always puts her money where her mouth is. We have seen such a physical match from these combatants, and the wear and tear is starting to show. And now the time where the smartest competitor needs to take advantage of the situation. Needs to figure out the quickest way to end this. Becky Lynch calls herself the man, and while it's great to be confident, she's got to know that confidence can't win the match. But Corey, it's not like she hasn't backed up her confidence in the ring. She hasn't done it yet in this match, and if her opponent knows what they're doing, they'll use Becky's overinflated sense of self to their advantage. Get her flustered, get her frustrated, then take advantage. Two. Look at this. Nia Jax is letting everyone know exactly how she feels. Destroy your face. Hammerlock. Hammerlock. Reverse DDT. She scurries out of there. She's got to remember to get back in the ring before the referee's 10 count. Becky Lynch may be slowing some here. She can withstand the punishment, though. Two. Oh, the reversal by Becky Lynch. Kick on the mark. Quick thinking by Nia Jax. Larian. Four. Oh, nasty Five. flipping center. Six. Seven. Oh, now it's Becky Lynch making her pay. There's a crucifix, nicely done. Pitfall attempt there from Becky Lynch. And an easy kick out. Try for it early. Oh, an overhand shot. Are you kidding me? For the first time tonight, Nia Jax incoming. Big miss right there. Headbutt. What should Becky Lynch try to do differently at this stage to stay in this thing? She may have underestimated the opposition she'd face tonight. Look at this. Nia Jax is letting everyone know exactly how she feels. Will she win it here? And Becky Lynch powers out. Becky's as beautiful as an Irish landscape and as tough as an Irish steak. Becky Lynch, set up the win. Becky Lynch makes the cover. One, two, and no kick out for Nia Jax. My 
nice kick out there. Nice takedown by Becky looking for the arm lock. Disarmor. It's got to be over. How in the world can you get Nia in a submission hold? I didn't think we'd see it, but I think we could see the impossible. Nia could tap out. Oh, and she gets out of it. She has renewed life now, Michael. Oh, the reversal by Becky Lynch. There's the crucifix. Nicely done. Look at this. Leg drop. It's not finished yet. How about another? It's in. I can't believe she's hanging on this long. She's got a tap. No escape, only surrender. Becky's a pump. Becky Lynch wins. A rare moment of weakness for Nia Jax. On display right there. is going to explode sooner rather than later. She's got a DDT! Forearm to the face! Oh, nothing fancy about that. Proving tough to catch. Not good for the back and body. Oh, she's not looking good here. The first thing she needs to do is somehow get out of that corner. That striking blow. Gotta find a way to get out of this. The WWE United States title is on the line, a title with so much history. Well, the winner almost becomes the defender of the red, white, and blue. Well, that is, unless they choose to use the title to insult Americans, as some have. Hey, it's the title holder's freedom to do so, Saxton. Oh. Close line over the top! Man. Too quick to catch him there. Wow, what a sequence. Great offense by John Cena. He's stuck in the corner now. What a counter. Phenomenal blitz. Oh, look at the baseball slide. Whoa! What a hurricane. Shoulders down now. Is it enough to retain the championship? Not yet.
And look at the quickness by Cena. Back suplex. Byron, what does John Cena have to focus on in this match if he wants to topple AJ Styles? Here we go. Body on body. Wow. Plenty of fight left. There's a reason AJ is one of the greatest performers in sports entertainment, folks. Oh. Kick right to the midsection. Waist. Oh, the reversal by AJ Styles. Oh. The challenger eating up some damage. It's nothing he hasn't been through before. Missile drop kick finds its mark. Cover by the champ. This one's far from over. Hey, I guess you never know. Oh, it's Cena turning the tables. Close line. Well, oh, that'll leave a mark. And look at the... And here we go. Not looking to the arm bar. John Cena is all fired up. Styles is always thinking. He might have been waiting on that one. Oh, here we go! No, oh, he knew that was coming. Not safe yet. For the win to retain the championship! Yeah, he's not done yet. And the referee starts his 10 count. A face oh. first. Touch. John Cena with a nice reversal. Two. Saw that one coming. And again, Cena going to the top rope. John Cena unloading extra heavy offense here with multiple attacks from the top rope. I don't know how much more damage AJ Styles can take. We're about to find out. He was the favorite for this match, but that's changing rapidly. AJ Styles might be headed for a rare loss unless he turns things around. Frustration must be mounting in both Styles and Cena. How much longer will it take to decide a winner? Go all night, gentlemen. I don't care. This is awesome. Six. Seven. Eight. Ooh. What a punch. That's how you stop your opponent. Look at the power from Cena. Ah, oh, Cena with a face buster. One. Two. Hooked up. And mention of Gutierrez. Absolutely planted. And he's heading back in. Uh-oh. 
We're going to see it. Power. Three. Sit down. Power bomb. More than five moves. This is the Cena that's just about unstoppable. And John Cena with so much pent up. Of oh, and he finds a way to escape. Wow. Cole, I think this entire arena has written him off, myself included. Phenomenal. 